Well, some of the employees at this Better Buzz tell me they started considering unionizing at the beginning of the year. And today they had enough votes to make that happen. Better Buzz in Hillcrest is always busy. Its employees say they enjoyed the job, but Friday there was more than the smell of coffee in the air. It feels really good. I mean, we worked really hard for this. I'm feeling amazing. I'm so glad all of all of our hard work paid off. I'm just looking forward to like happier employees. Happier employees because they overwhelmingly voted to unionize and joined the United Food and Commercial Workers Union Local 135. The conversations started back in January. That kind of joke of like, what if we unionize? What? That would be crazy if we unionize and then turned into Wait, what if we unionized? Employees tell us they wanted better pay, more consistent schedules, and benefits like health care and PTO. Currently, they say they make minimum wage, $16.85 an hour, and say Better Buzz doesn't qualify for the state's new fast food law that bumps the minimum wage to 20 bucks because they have less than 60 locations nationwide. Such a struggle, especially at this time where rent and food is so expensive. It's just not something people should be having to worry about. They're not the only coffee shop in the county to unionize. In the last year, three Starbucks locations have done the same thing. It's part of a larger push in general in the country um, of people wanting more of a voice at their work. Now these coffee shop workers will start negotiating a contract and they're looking forward to it. I'm excited. I mean, I feel like I'm going to come in tomorrow. Everybody's going to be smiling. I'm just really, really excited to see the energy that we carry. ABC 10 News reached out to Better Buzz for comment multiple times over the last several weeks, including Friday before and after the union vote, and still haven't heard back. In Hillcrest, Laura Acevedo, ABC 10 News.